Hello and welcome back, or just welcome if you're new here. I'm Brandon Rainese. You are watching Overland Exposures, and today we're in Jackson Hole, Wyoming, shooting some wildlife with the Sigma 150 to 600 millimeter. Almost everything that you're going to see today was shot using this and the Canon EOS R, and I am using an adapter on this, but that didn't really affect the performance. This is not going to be an in-depth, comprehensive review of the lens. This is actually just going to be like a vlog mixed with some photos that I took. Stay tuned for a more in-depth, comprehensive review, though, because because once I get some more time with this, I think that uh, it deserves a review. Maybe consider subscribing. If not, that's cool too, whatever. I hope you like the vlog. Today we're doing two of my favorite things, technically three. We are taking the drive in the Jeep and we are going to be shooting some wildlife, both photo and video. It's gonna be in a place that I haven't been to in a very long time. It's Jackson, Wyoming. Uh, Grand Teton, we got bighorn sheep, moose, possibly some otters. There's a lot of wildlife there right now. I'm gonna be meeting my friend John and um, hopefully getting some amazing footage and some amazing shots. It is gonna be cold. Originally I was thinking I would just sleep in the Jeep, but uh, uh, I think I'll spend in fuel overnight what I would on like a Motel 6. So we'll kind of cross that bridge when we get there and see how the weather is. This is going to be the primary lens that I'm going to be using. It's a Sigma 150 to 600 millimeter. It's got, uh, you know, 5 to 6.3. So as we zoom in, it's going to be a little bit darker. Probably going to have to rely a little bit more on the ISO of the camera. Um, but it's a great lens. Thank you to my good buddy John for lending it to me. I don't have anything that has this far of a reach, so um, I just got off shift. I'm tired, I'm exhausted. It's only like a five or six hour drive in the snow though, so we should be fine. Just got off the phone with John. He says he's been getting reports. Grizzly bear, bighorn sheep, great horned owls, wolves. There should be a whole bunch of cool stuff. Maybe even some moose, some elk. Who knows what we're gonna find. It should be pretty easy to get on something, fingers crossed. I've got like five hours to go here on the road. We're gonna stop off, take some pictures along the way. Maybe take a nap. Just kind of depends. I got a Red Bull. Let's start with that. Hi ho! Well, I slept through sunrise. John's already out taking pictures. I was so tired. All right, you guys, we're here. We're on the sheep. It's incredible. comes. Here you come. Oh, 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 oh.
All right, well, we tried to get some rams while they're in rut, smashing heads. Just wasn't working out today. They're uh, on the move, so we are gonna go find something new. All right, you guys, we've got some moose. The only problem is that they are like way over here. We want them over here by this awesome backdrop. So we're gonna have to like take a hike out there and shoot from back behind them towards the Tetons. It's seriously hard to get a bad shot when you're here. This doesn't do it justice. It's just, it's massive. It's amazing. behind them are killing me. I can't get them out of the shot. We're starting to lose light, and they're still bedded down. I don't know if we're gonna get a good shot or not. Wow, that happened really quickly. They all just stood up and started eating, we're losing light. I think I got some good shots though. I'm excited to get back to the hotel and check them out. That was really cool. That was a blast. Pretty epic. <laughs> wow. Day two, and I'm ready for sunrise this time. We're gonna head back to where we saw all those moose last night, and hopefully we can catch them there again for sunrise because it's such an epic background with the Grand Teton and all that stuff, so let's go. Camera, backpack, batteries are charged, lunch. Are you ready? Yeah, we're ready. You ready? I'm ready. I think I'm gonna head to the sheep. What do you think? You gonna give it a whack? Yeah, man, I think so. Sheep still up the hill, they haven't come down close enough. They've been bashing heads, which is cool. Got a little bit of video of it, but I haven't got a good capture of it because they're just too far for me to shoot. So, 
Better luck next time, probably. Thanks for watching, you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like and maybe consider subscribing too. Also, if you want to see more pictures that I took on this trip, head on over to my Instagram. I will link that in the description down below. See ya.